Hey guys, what's good? And today I'm playing Mimic Search. Um, apparently this is meant to be about a police officer investigating a mimic attack. Don't know what a mimic attack is. Actually, wait one second. <laughs> okay, a mimic is able to change its shape to disguise its body as an inanimate object, commonly a chest. What? Right, so I guess we're dealing with some sort of doppelganger type thing? Okay, fair enough. Oh god. Made by Gemzil. Oh god, not driving again. It's, 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 okay, let's drive. Oh, it always starts with driving, doesn't it? If it no. No. Oh my god, I stopped driving for a second. I thought I was about to lose my life. I should investigate the crime scene. That is what you do if you're a police officer. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. Hello, officer. <laughs> so, what have you got here? An abandoned car, a lake of blood, and no body. Could be anything. And no valuables are missing. Clearly just a bear attack, right? So probably a mimic doing its work. Right, so we know what mimics are. Yes, I think that's obvious. Okay. The car was smoking when I arrived here. I think the victim was driving up this road and had to stop because the engine had an issue. The victim called roadside assistance while a mimic was hiding behind a bush. Okay. Um... This is kind of weird. So they're making it from the perspective that we know what mimics are. That thing was probably one of the big ones. There's a huge footprint in front of the car. She didn't have a chance. Huh. How old is the victim? 37 years old according to her ID. Is this area known for mimic activity? No, not at all. But it seems like they're expanding their territory. I bet the effer, demonetized, is still close. Probably somewhere in the woods digesting her. What a weird thing to say as a police officer, you creep. You're sent to take care of it? Yes, that's why I'm here. I'm tasked with finding and neutralizing it. Bro, this is about to become an action game real quick. I'll drive around the area and ask if someone has seen something suspicious. Sounds like a plan. No, it does not. Driving around and hoping for the best is not a plan. You have a map of the area in your laptop, right? Yep, Google Maps is a thing, bro. Sounds good. If you want, you can take a look at the crime scene yourself in case I missed anything. Honestly, this guy doesn't look very competent, so I will do that. See you later, fuck off. Oh wait, no swearing. A lot of blood, but not a single piece of flesh. Huh. Is this a larder? Am I Narasha? The victim's car. Staying inside would have been safer. Hmm. Is that it? Huh. It doesn't look like there's anything, and I am not wandering far from here. Also, there's no blood trail. You would have thought that if the lady had been taken, right, there would have been a trail or some sort of evidence as to where they went. I am not going in there to check. That is not my pay grade, bro. Are you- can I talk to you? No? Yeah, he, he's no help, is he? So, well, let's do what we said. Let's drive around and see if we find anything. Um, Okay, from Nathan. Hello, a few hours ago, we received an anonymous call from someone reporting. After that, drive around the area, use your map. All right, well, here's the map. So I'll, I'll leave that there. I assume you can die in this game, so stopping is probably not a wise thing, so I'll drive and... Drive and map. Alright! We will get to the bottom of this. Okay... Huh. This is kind of weird. Um, let's check the map. So, gas station. So that is where we were. So apparently this is at an intersection. I'm going to try and see if we can head around the circle before we head off. Um, 
All right. What can you guys tell me about this mimic attack? Hello, Stormin. What can I do you for? There was a mimic attack just down the road. Damn, that's bad for business. At least you're a good person. Do you know anything that could help me with the search? I haven't noticed anything weird so far. Everything is just as always. It's kind of sus, bro. Really? Nothing at all? No. Only thing I know is that you should be very careful. Nowadays, there's extre they're extremely good at pretending to be human. And they're more dangerous than ever. People say they're evolving and learning from humans. Thanks, but that information is already known to us. Anyway, thanks. Don't you want to buy something or fill up your car, sir? I'm good, thanks. Oh, good luck with the search officer. Yeah, this guy has got a crap store, so I'm out of here. All right. Well, that was a dead end. Okay, um, let's head to the motel. I feel like the, the motel will be a good place. Turning circle of this car's dog. All right. Hmm, okay. I assume this is the motel, right? Whoa. Weird. Wait, is... Is this not the motel? Oh. Oh, I must have taken the, the other way, so I'm at the trailer park. Okay. Um... Well, it's as good a place as any on this pla on this on this journey. Um Hmm. What the fuck do you want? Easy there, pal. I'm just here to ask a few questions. People don't like cops around here. Make it quick. America. I'm here for an investigation. A mimic was active in the area around the nearby gas station. Shit, that's where I get my beer. Ah, oh, fuck that place. Too expensive anyway. This guy has got his life figured out. Do you know anything that would be useful to me? Nope. I'm drinking all day. Nothing else to do around here. People here don't believe the official narrative. They say the government uses them to keep the population down. Ooh. That's, that's a pretty epic theory, to be honest. They don't like us common folk. They use them to get rid of us. Ooh. This is not true, otherwise we wouldn't try to neutralize them. Well, you say that, but... So have you noticed anything odd in the last days? No, not at all. Everything is as always. Try your luck somewhere else, cop. Good night, you prick. I'm not talking with cops. I just want to ask a few questions. As I said, I'm not talking with cops. Okay, can I talk to other people here? Damn, this is scary. Um, hello? Wait, so the people here hate cops and they feel like the mimics are a government conspiracy. So this whole thing about the imposters is, um, is known. It's common knowledge. That's kind of weird. Normally games make it so that you don't know what the monster is before you get stuck in, but here everyone knows. Huh. I don't like this. This is making me kind of uneasy. Um, before I head down the, the, like, before I head down this road where there's nothing for ages, I kind of want to go to the motel now. So I'm going to go back the way I came. I don't know why, but I've got a suspicious feeling that I want to go to the motel before I go to the the farm or anywhere else. So that's where I'm going. Yeah, so I'm not going that way. Sometimes you have to trust your instincts as a police officer and do what's right. Right, so this is where I was before and instead I want to go here. Okay, we're going to get to the bottom of this, I promise you. Right, so now this must be the motel coming up here. Yeah, okay. Uh, right, let's pull in. Okay. 
If I was an imposter monster, this is where I would go. Alright, before I talk to whoever's in there, let's look ar around here. Do we see anything suspicious? Alright, so there's someone in here. Can't go in. There's someone in here, because the, the, the blinds are shut. Uh. Let's just... Did I see something down there? Hello? 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 Hmm. Well, if there was something there, I didn't see it. Hello, clerk? How may I help you, sir? I'm here because a mimic was active down the road. Do you have anything that could help me? A mimic, you say? Damn. I just hope I'll never meet one of these things. I don't know if I believe you now. Hmm. I myself haven't noticed anything weird, but there's a farm east from here. Maybe they can help you more than I do. You could also follow the road up north. There's an area that is used for camping. Alright, thank you for your time. Yeah, I knew it was good to come here before go- wait. Uh, you see, though, this is the thing that's messing with me, because because anyone that oh, I'm going insane. Anyone that I meet could be the mimic. Anyone could be the imposter. Who is the imposter? All right, so. Yeah, let's head to the farm, which is just off here, and then we'll go to the campsite. We've been to the trailer park already, and all that was there was those useless drunks. Okay, is the farm through here? Looks like it. The thing is, am I not meant to find the Mimic, though? Because. How could I possibly find the Mimic if they can shapeshift? So, I could be talking to the farmer here, but I'm actually talking to the Mimic the entire time. Oh, I do not like this one bit. I do not like this at all. <gasps> May I help you, officer? Damn, you scared the crap out of me. Are you the owner of this farm? Yes, this is my property, sir. Okay. Mr. Liberty, calm down. I'm here because we have reports of mimic activity in the area. Do you know anything that could help me out? Let me think for a second. Not really. I haven't noticed anything weird. But I also heard rumors about people seeing or hearing them in the woods. I personally don't fear them. I can I can tell. You've got your freedom there, bro. I make sure to lock all doors and keep my rifle close to me. Thank you for your time. If you notice something weird, make sure to forward that information to the police. Have a good night. Good night and stay safe. Where is he going? Hmm. I'm getting... Whoa. Is this window open? No. Oh, you see, I really want to explore, but I also really don't want to fucking die. Hmm. Let's check the barn, because it's too obviously open, right? There has to be something here. Otherwise, why would it be open? Why would the game allow you to come in here? Okay, well, I, honest to God, don't see anything in here, so... Hmm. This is mysterious. This is very, very weird. And it's very tense. Alright, well... I guess the next place is the, the camping spot now, right? I don't want to go to the other place just yet. Um, I'm going to go... Um, 
Do I want to go back the way I came? Probably not. Um, okay. I'll head this way and then turn left to go to the the camping site. Oh god, I thought I saw something, but I don't want to stop. Oh, this is so weird because there might not be anything actually out here that's, you know, threatening to me as the player. But it's so tense. My anus is tight. Crap, I'm lost. Um Holy g No. I did not just see that. Yep, I did just see that. Oh. Uh. Uh. I'm gonna die, fuck it. Got any spare change, officer? Sure, here, take this. Thank you so much. I'm here to investigate a mimic report. Do you have anything to help me out? A mimic? Oh, that's bad. Really bad. I hear screams sometimes, at night. Do you see this road going up there? I think there's a house. And? The screams were coming from there, I think. You should take a look. I guess I'll have to. Thanks, and make sure to stay out of trouble. Okay, so... That leads down to the cabin. Before I go there and die, let me see the camping site first. Jesus. That actually panicked me. Like, that was actually like almost fight or flight. Like, I was actually about to just run away. Okay, um, so I assume this will be the, the campsite, right? Okay. All right, let's see what we've got here. I don't see anything or anyone. The lights are on though. Hello, is someone in there? What do you want? I'm a police officer. I'm here to investigate a mimic related incident. Can I talk to you for a second? We can talk, but I'll keep this door closed for my own safety. That's not an issue. So you know anything that could help me out? No, not me, but there's a homeless guy. Last night he came up to my tent wanting some change. He said some stuff about hearing screams coming from the woods. Okay, I know that's true. I thought he was bullshitting me or that he was on something. Anyway, if you want to talk to him, just follow the road eastwards. Will do. Thanks for your time. Stay safe, officer. I will. Okay, well, we know that person can't be a mimic, and we know the homeless guy can't be a mimic because their stories actually corroborate one another. But we are entering endgame now. It looks like the, the cabin... The cabin is where we'll find our mimic, and where we will settle this. Well... I always enjoyed being a police officer. Alright, let's look for this guy again. Where is he? Okay. Uh, uh, Alright. Come on. Let's not be afraid. We ain't scared of no mimic. Okay, I'm starting to get a little bit more scared now. Okay, I'm really starting to panic. Okay, I don't like this. Oh my god, the door's open. Oh, oh, oh god. Alright, just remember your police training. And shoot everything that moves. Is there a mimic in here? I'll save you, ma'am. I'll save you. Is 
Is that coming from outside? Hmm. I mean, I can't open this door, but... It's coming from down here. This is definitely the Mimic, but, you know, whatever. I've got a gun, bro. Hello? Ma'am? Oh my god, this is terrifying. Ma'am, I'm coming! Ma'am? Oh, I'm close. I'm very close now. Ma'am! This actually sounds like it's right on top of me. I don't see anything! Come out! Oh my god. This is just awful. I don't hear anything. I don't hear anything. God. Oh my god, a shiver went down my spine and my arms and my legs. Come on, show yourself. I'm not afraid. Ugh. Die! Yes! Yes! You see that? You see that gameplay? Cool, calm, collected cucumbers. I didn't panic for a second there. I came, I saw, and I shot my enemy where it hurts. Oh, bro, that, that was scary. That final bit where you're going through the forest, I got a shiver when you the screaming stops and then you hear a roar. I'm going to rate this game an 8.5 out of 10. The game was pretty short and I feel like um, it was kind of meant for you to like encounter the different um, NPCs in different orders for it to like flow well. But the horror aspect was really good. So yeah, eight and a half out of ten. Solid game. But yeah, let me know what you thought of this. I enjoyed this and yeah, let me know your thoughts. Peace.